Good afternoon, guys. Um, so today um, I have something that I want to talk about. And it's actually kind of funny because it comes up a lot, almost weekly. And um, so it's about um, con artists <laughs> and uh, people who make my work look bad. Um, so there's a lot of people who claim to be psychic mediums, curanderas, um, whatever you want to call it. Um, I don't know. They, they go by different names. So a lot of times I'll have someone call me in complete fear and distress that um, they met someone and this person claims to be a psychic or something and tells them that they have this demonic attachment and they're going to have to go to the mountains or they're going to have to travel to go find this this medicine to cleanse them and you have to pay them five thousand dollars ten thousand dollars and every time you give them money they make you give them more um and then if you start to catch on and say you know what i'm not doing this no more they threaten to curse you and all this bullshit because they'll be like oh you gave me all your information you gave me your photo your name your date of birth and all your personal stuff and your bank accounts and things like that um anytime someone tells you that olympia or a cleansing is over a 100 bucks i'm sorry um i i i have to disagree with that um, I've been doing this work almost my whole life. Um, I'll be 48 and I've seen some intense, serious things and situations, um, that, uh, require lots of prayer and, um, mostly God. Um, so if this is something that you're a victim of, please run, um, contact me and I'll give you a cleanse for $25. If you want to fix seven day candle with that, it'll be 40 bucks. Um, that's, that's probably a very reasonable price that you'll find anywhere um so please don't let these people uh instill fear in you they're full of shit they're liars um they're not doing anything for you they're not even going to be able to prove the work that they supposedly done to remove whatever it is they're saying um so again i'm sorry these people exist they suck i actually uh went out and met someone on 35 because she was threatening a client and she was definitely full of shit. Um, she even has a billboard sign off 35 between here and San Marcos, I believe. So um, watch out, guys. Um, just cover your ass and come see me if you need to. I'll take care of you. Have a good day.